Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Jessica. This is the BBTV News for Thursday, February 8, 2018. What's up, Bobcats? I'm Tia, starting you off with our top stories of the day. Did you guys hear? On Sunday, February 4th, Kylie Jenner has just announced that she was pregnant with the baby girl and had given birth to her newborn baby on Thursday, February 1st. This is Kylie Jenner's first child and proved everyone who thought the pregnancy was a hoax wrong. Jenner did not want to announce it yet until she was ready, but it was confirmed by family members in September of 2017. Hi, Bobcats. I'm Taylor. Were you watching the Super Bowl halftime show? If so, you might have seen JT snap a pic with one of his fans during the performance. Meet 13-year-old Ryan from Massachusetts. Mas Ryan is a huge fan of Justin and describes him as his favorite singer. He started out the once-in-a-lifetime encounter by experiencing some technical difficulties, saying, at first I tried to get a selfie with him, but my phone died, and then it turned back on. But I got the picture with him. Ryan said it was just so cool, I was speechless. The New England Patriots fan added that Tim Blake didn't really say anything during the encounter. Even though his beloved Patriots lost the Super Bowl, the Philadelphia Eagles won 41-33, and Ryan had a night he'll never forget. So Bobcats, who is one celebrity you would want to take a picture with? That's all for our top story today. Now let's spin over to BBTV Sports Zone. Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Jackson, and you've just entered the BBTV Sports Zone. First up in Buffett Sports this week, on Tuesday night, the girls' basketball team traveled to Nathan Hill, and tonight they will be playing Mars at home. Make sure you come out and support. Yesterday, the boys' swim team competed against Nathan Hill. On Tuesday, the wrestling team went against Nathan Hill at home, and tonight they're traveling to Monroe to face King. Make sure you continue to support the Buffett sports. In other sports news, tomorrow will be the start of the 2018 Winter Olympics. This year, it's taking place in South Korea from February 9th to the 25th. That's all for sports today. Now on to the Buffett bench. Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Emmy with today's Buffett binge. First up, we have some spoilers for Stranger Things Season 3, so cover your ears if you haven't started watching this amazing show. Stranger Things Season 3 will be coming out in 2019, given that Season 2 had come out in October 2017. And as you all know, we saw Callie in the second season, and now the Duffer brothers are saying they will be bringing her back. Stranger Things Season 3 will have eight to nine episodes. We all know who Dr. Brenner is, right? Well, sadly, he is still alive and might be featured more. The Duffer brothers have also said that they will be working on characters' development, making the characters go on a special journey. That's all for the Buffett Binge. Now onto the BBTV feature of the day. Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Madison, and I'm here with the feature of the day. The Tyrannosaurus Rex has been extinct for about 65 million years, but you wouldn't know that from all the recent sightings. A popular costume has popped up everywhere, the Major League Baseball to the, from, the, from the Major League Baseball game to the White House. It is a T-Rex takeover in Portland, Maine recently. A prehistoric flash mob at the Monument Square was aimed at spreading smiles. A bunch were running a marathon and even one kayaking his way down the flooded street. And don't think the T-Rex is afraid of a little snow. It comes out in any weather, rain, or shine. That's all for the feature of the day. Now it's time for Buffett's announcements. Hi Bobcats, it's Jessica, and I'm here with your daily announcements. First up, when it snows outside, things can get pretty slippery. Students, please remember to use shovels, sidewalks, and to avoid walking through large areas of snow and potentially falling down. Additionally, students are discouraged to pick up snow and are not allowed to throw snow at all. Remembering these few details will ensure that all students stay safe and warm when we have snow on the ground. Bobcats, remember to bring your money to Bobcat Den through this Friday to buy Happy Grams for all of your friends. They are only a dollar, so it's a great deal. National Junior Honor Society members will be coming to your Bobcat Den to sell Happy Grams through this Friday. Don't forget to bring your box tops into your Bobcat Den throughout February. 
Team 7B is now blowing away the competition, so it's almost certain they will have a pizza party in their future. Will your team beat them? Finally, are you washing your hands? This year has been especially bad for those who have gotten the flu. Doctors are even saying that the flu shot isn't working as people thought it would this season. So make sure you are covering your mouth when you cough or sneeze and remember to wash your hands. Thanks for watching our broadcast today. This has been Jessica. Have a great Thursday and we'll see you tomorrow.